Claire is my jam. <laughs> Why do we love Claire Underwood so much? I don't know, maybe you all need to go to therapy. Oh, uh, well, <laughs> my therapist is on board with my love of Claire Underwood. Yeah, she's so intimidating and fierce. And ruthless. And ruthless and manipulative. All these qualities that we so admire. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you. How do you see Claire? Because you have to play her from your perspective, right? I know, and it's so interesting when you hear these Descriptives. Descriptives yeah. that are so, you know, the venal and the calculating and the, I just see her as really efficient. <laughs> she is so efficient. You know, she's the gal that gets uh, things done no matter what it takes. Yeah. How do, you, how do you think she's different than her predecessor, than Frank? Um, I think they're pretty much the same. She just wears a dress. How are you feeling about the series coming to an end? This is the final season. This is it. I know, it's bittersweet, always. Yeah. I refuse to accept it. They so do. I'll see you next year for season nine. But did, <laughs> did they, was it always the intent that Claire would become president even early on at the beginning? Always, from Is the that beginning. Right? Yeah, it was oh, how God. do we get there? Mm. Uh -huh. <laughs> Who do we have to kill for her to become Well, every, uh, apparently everyone. <laughs> everyone there were so everyone. many people that had to die, but I'm, I was behind it, 100%. <laughs> yeah, I'm always on, on Claire's side in every scenario. This is not, the FBI is on the phone in the back. <laughs> they're like, they're reaching out to you right now. House of Cards, it's the sixth and six. final season. She thinks just six. Yeah. It premieres November 2nd on Netflix. Robin Wright.